Well, it's official. Nobody's won the Masters yet, but Podrick Harrington, golf's newest social media influencer, has won the internet with his daily golf tips. I used to do this as a kid with the household windows the far side. Take a long practicing. Oh, sugar. Oh, sugar. Hey, easy on, Paddy. By the way, you need an editor, pal. Rule number one of being an influencer, don't put every single thing on social media. Rule number two, only put up the good stuff. Case in point, Lee Westwood. What a specimen. Lee broke the golf internet with that video. And Mr. Universe himself responded to him. Lee, you may have broke the golf internet, but thankfully, Poulter fixed it. Look, don't worry. The golf will come back. But the PGA Tour announced when it does come back, it may do so with no fans. But is no fans really a big deal to players? I mean, will golfers really miss the golf clap? Uh, well, I think the PGA Tour playing with our supporters is a good thing. As uh, I plan on retiring in about four or five years, so uh, who's going to watch it? No one. And Francesco Molinari? Totally against playing golf with no fans. I, for one, will not play without fans. I need to feel their electricity. That's where I get all of my energy from. And Patrick Reed is just totally confused. Fans? Did we ever play with fans? You know who loves the idea of empty galleries? Joel Cava. Mm. If you didn't know, he's Tiger Woods' caddy, and he and Woods are being sued by a fan who claims he was injured when he was shoved while taking a selfie at the Valspar Championship in 2018. The victim alleges he suffered bodily injury, mental anguish, and loss of capacity for the enjoyment of life. And all he wants from Tiger is a signed glove. And $6.5 million. But that's all. The cases are real. The rulings are final. This is Judge Gary. Tiger Woods and his caddy are being accused of shoving a fan at a tournament two years ago when he attempted to take a selfie. The victim's lawyer, Matthew McConaughey, is seeking damages of $6.5 million. All right, what's this? A full-grown man taking a selfie? Wow, his injuries look bad. No, Your Honor, my client just had an incident in the bathroom with some TP, so everything's all right, all right, all right. All right, get on with it. Your Honor, I have my first witness. I would like to call to the stand the greatest golfer in the world. So, Mr. Woods, can you tell me what happened on 13 at Valspar? Well, the conditions were really tough out there. They were really tough. We know the conditions are tough, Tiger, but what did your caddy Joey do on the 13th hole? Well, I took a three-wheel off the tee, and I pushed it right. And uh, I was shocked at what Joey did, like really shocked. Yeah. He gave me a bad yardage. I was like, dude, come on. I ended up with No, rough. no, no, Mr. Woods. What happened after you went in the rough? When my client went to take a selfie? Oh, that. Well, I got up now for par, which felt really, really good. I'm... Your Honor, please. Tell the truth, Tiger. <sighs> Did your caddy shove my client? Well... The conditions were really tough out there. They were really tough. Tiger, we want answers. You want answers? I want the truth. You can't handle the truth. <laughs> the truth is, every week I play, the ratings go up, the gallery swell. I draw the fans in. Who's going to do it? Cooch? Huh? You, Franny? Who? Oh, me? Calm down, Mr. Molinari! I'm sorry. <sighs> I did what I had to do, and I'd do it again. Did you order the code red? Damn right I did. No further questions. What the hell is a code red? 